Mitch McGovern, number 41, Adelaide Crows. Um, my nickname from pretty much day one has been Shooter. Um, obviously off to uh, Happy Gilmore, Shooter McGavin, so my last name is McGovern. But they also just call me Gov, short. Uh, my family, got mother Michelle, father Andrew and my brother Jeremy, who's two years older than myself. I supported the Fremantle Dockers. Uh, the old man played for Freo, and yeah, it's just the whole WA thing. Go for Freo, hate West Coast, so. What happened when Jezza went to West Coast? <laughs> yeah, I, I wasn't too happy, to tell you the truth. <laughs> but um, I still don't really support them. I support Jez, but yeah, I was always a Docker, so <laughs> it was tough. Um, my favourite player, I got two. Um, one of them is James Podziadley. Uh, he's at the club now, so it's a great honour to play alongside and train with him. Um, and also Jared Ruffhead. Have you told Pods that? No, I haven't, so hopefully, <laughs> hopefully he doesn't watch this. <laughs> uh, my best junior football achievement was winning three premierships in the Colts. I guess running back with the fly of the ball, trying to take a mark in the goal square and hitting the goal post was probably my most embarrassing. It took a while to get back up, so everyone was laughing at me, even the umpire had a bit of a giggle, so. For myself, uh, anything Kanye West, so Homecoming's normally my song of choice. If I wasn't on an AFL list, I'll be competing with one of my old colleagues, Mel, for top spot as a cradle officer. So she'll love that that I'm calling her out, so. I, I swear these guys have been pretty good as a kid. For myself, I was in a lot of trouble with everything. So, um, what age are we talking about? Probably the worst. Do we need to break into a bracket? Yeah, <laughs> give, give me a timeline, I'll be here for hours. Um, probably a lot of school incidents, so just doing silly things, moving friends' cars where they shouldn't be and getting caught doing it, so. The scene, I see pranks every day, um, whether it's the smallest things of someone's thongs have gone missing. I saw earlier today Charlie was hunting around the locker room trying to find his thongs. Um, just little things like that you always see and pick up. I've got a few. Um, I don't like feet. Feet gross me out a lot. Um, and sharks and spiders probably up there. Uh, I played a lot of sports living in the country my whole, whole life pretty much. Um, but it goes down from fire brigade, soccer, basketball, uh, t-ball, netball, pretty much everything. I don't know, these guys are idiots. To impress a first date, you take a girl out to a nice restaurant. It's the first thing you would do. Um, I played everywhere. I had a few growth spurts when I was younger, so I was in the ruck, down back in the midfield for a bit. And I played up forward as well, so. The one thing I can't live without I don't know why these boys didn't say it's either, but food. I absolutely love food. The worst teammate, I have to agree with Rabsy and all the other boys, it's definitely Riley O'Brien. <laughs> he's, uh, he's a bit of a pest. Uh, it's good fun though, yeah.